is also very, very small. Working the very small cats, believe it or not, is actually more difficult than working the very big cats. If you're a 500 pound lion, you can afford to be pretty mellow. You know, not many animals are going to mess with a lion. Not many animals are foolish enough to walk up to a lion and say, I'm going to take away what you're eating. But when you're a very little cat, coming out in the open is scary because there's a lot of bigger things out there that are going to take you down. One of the conservationists that we partner with is Dr. Jim Sanderson. And Jim is the world leading expert on the little cat. And Jim has three years of St. Barb. Cheetahs are amazing, mountain lions are amazing, snow leopards are amazing, but people really need to know about the little guys. Most of you have never heard of a flat-headed cat, an Andean mountain cat, a palace cat, a pampas cat, a Chinese mountain cat, a fishing cat. These are all small cats that weigh somewhere between 5 and 10 pounds. They're not domestic cats, they are wild animals. And most of them are endangered. Most of them really, really need our help. So we have added a little cat to our program. She is still learning what Rob and I want her to do. Um, she is um, occasionally fairly nervous when she comes out, but she's also extremely nosy. So what we've been asking her to do is, as you see her crate is on the table, she will come out, she'll go back in, She'll come out. We're teaching her that Rob and I are not going to let anything bad happen to her, that coming to do the shows is a fun thing, and she doesn't have to be nervous. So just kind of please um, bear with us patiently. She will come out. Her name is Warani, and she is called a Joffrey's cat. The Joffrey's cat is a little cat that's found in South America. Okay. Hang on here. We're coming out. <laughs> Full grown, this cat is going to weigh a whopping six pounds. She is found in Brazil, Argentina, Chile, Uruguay, Paraguay. They're not found in the rainforest. She won't come back out. She's so nosy, she just can't stand it. Um, they're not found in the rainforest like the ocelot is. But she definitely wants to be in the chaparral, um, where there is brush, where there are leaves to hide under. Because if you think about it, being out in the open, a large monitor lizard is going to kill her, a large snake is going to kill her, a monkey, a puma, a jaguar. So she definitely wants to have places where she can hide. Um, because she's small, this cat eats 